Okay, here we are. Different location. It's deathmatch time again. Deathmatch in the pub. This time I have the Ariser Solo 2. The only vaporizer on the market named after a Star Wars film that hasn't been made yet. Funny joke, I have the Riser Air 2. Came out after the Solo 2. Little bit smaller, but some say it's a lot more powerful. We'll find out. Yes, not related to any uh, no sneakers. Star, uh, no, shoes. no Star Wars films, no or, shoes. Or shoes. Not Basketball like that. shoes. Yeah, yep. none of that. If you look, lovely, only so light, super light, only 116 grams. You wouldn't even feel it in your pocket. I can barely feel myself holding this now. And it's. I think if you let go of it, it might float up. I don't know how shockproof it is, so I'm not going to no, let don't anything do drop. That, but it might float up to the. And if you have a look against this pint, it's only 12.4 centimeters. So the portability is great on this. You can really take it anywhere you want. The only problem is you might lose it. It's that small. And, and like, you don't want to lose it in your paint. Definitely not. No. Definitely. Do not. Definitely not. Do that. Mm. And you get all these accessories with it just to make it a little bit easier on you. If you have a look at this, you put your dry herb in through there. So it's efficient that for is your herb. A nice feature, but the Solo 2 even looks a little bit like a lightsaber, even though it is not a lightsaber. And Hansel will never use lightsabers. Did you never use it? I don't know. I probably did at one point. Right, so, and this one is just out of juice at the minute. But you get to see if these different kept these are all glass as well. So there's an all glass airflow. Yeah. Flow. Helps the taste of the vape. Helps the taste of the vape because then you don't taste the plastic, the plastic yeah. or anything else that it might be. So that's I think, and and we do you know what's like really super cool. Do you know the way Han Solo carries a blaster? No. In his belt, he does. Well, this is like a little belt thing, so you can feel like Han Solo because you, you can put your put your vaporizer in there and like your mouthpiece and all goes in there and then it's actually got a belt clip so you can clip it on your belt and walk around you can show everybody and you look your cool you look and super you, cool you look really cool and you're, you're telling everybody that you're cool yeah at the same you're time you're showing it off you're showing it it's off it's really radiating radiating off you if you're wearing that yeah you know it's i mean it's it's also a fashion choice this mm. vaporizer you know a lot of a lot of vaporizers you don't get to you know show your individuality in terms of your fashion choices Maybe don't wear it in front of the police if you are in a region where certain dry herbs are not yet legal. Smart advice. Smart advice. Yes. The Riser Air comes with so many accessories. It also comes with a wee belt clip. A little bit smaller than the Solo 2. You dropped something. I dropped something. Again. Do not eat. Good advice also. So you can clip that onto your belt and you got your Oh my god, you blew you've blown my mind. I know. I didn't know you had a belt clip. You could do that with this guy too. Yeah, just perfect. And you got this if you wanna clean anything at all or mix up the herb a little bit. And you also have these other two which are just like this, only a little bit taller. So really perfect for anyone who wants to it use it. It kind of makes you feel like you're, do you remember where you were, it was Christmas time when you were a kid and you got a chemistry set and you got all these wee bits and you was like, oh, that's so cool and we do this. And then you just kicked it under your bed and you never saw it again, yeah. remember? Yeah, but don't kick this under your bed because no. you're going to need everything to stuff. fully enjoy the riser air too. In fact, maybe go and have a look under your bed and see if you can find that old chemistry set because it probably still works and you might be able to get some fun out of it. Maybe. What else does the, the riser air have in store for us? Getting the box open isn't the easiest thing. But that's just because it's so well made. Oh yeah, so, and the, the Solo 2 is made from carefully sourced uh, materials. So like, 
You know the way a lot of people just when they're sourcing their materials, they're just like, ah, that'll do. Yeah, I don't care where I'm ah, from. Ah, I don't care. I don't care. Mm. You know, I mean, ah, that'll do. Not these guys. The guys that are, are a razor, they put an awful lot of effort. They really carefully probably put on like special gloves, maybe protective equipment. <clears throat> Be super careful about sourcing your materials. Mm, yeah. That's good to know, isn't it? Get on a riser for doing it. Yeah, not everyone yeah. does it. Not everyone does, but these guys go the extra mile. That's why I like in a company. Yeah, yeah, me too. Also, you get 75 minutes of usage from this tiny what? wee vapor vaporizer. I couldn't believe it when I was reading it, but you have it, and if it is dead, you can just charge it for. Five to ten minutes and you can be back vaping in no time which i thought was a great way feature an easily chargeable battery and uh, what kind of heating is there in this gear it's funny R2? you should mention that it's convection it's and not, conduction it's, it's a hybrid it's not funny i should mention that we talked about this before we started making the video do you not remember no no uh, I, I actually said don't bring up anything we talked about you know yeah don't break uh, the four sorry hole. i just did you yeah. know uh, okay, well that's great. Hybrid, you say? Hybrid. The Solo 2 is also hybrid. Best of both worlds. Look at how slick and lovely it is. It looks like it could have come from the Death Star. It is that cool. It could like, like... With Darth Vader. Like if you, if if you, it? Like if you kicked r 2 d 2 that might fall out. <laughs> that's what that looks like. What about warranty? The Riser r 2 On r 2 d 2 yeah, do you know about that? I have no idea what the warranty on R2D2 would be. What well, about the vaporizer though? Do you know that? Oh, uh, well, what's it for the year? Well, it's a two year warranty with a one year warranty on the replaceable battery. Wow, well, because they're made from the same company, I'm just gonna imagine that the warranty is the same. That's fair because enough. Because I don't know. That's okay. You don't have to know everything. Well, one person can't know everything and if you they know. said they did they'd be a liar they'd be lying yeah yeah i don't no, like liars no one likes a liar no no everyone likes the riser air too and, and everybody well, likes bro silicate glass don't they that's just obvious comes with a 100 percent satisfaction guarantee from a riser satisfaction guarantee yeah close enough you knew close what i was enough. saying i do Yes, I suppose if you're if you're death matching vaporizers and you're you know you've had some Guinness maybe a clatter faction <laughs> iron cage. But well, yeah, so who's the winner in the death match? Well, I do like the look of the Riser Air Two a little bit better than the Solo, but I think I'm gonna have to give it to the Solo before its ease of use. And longer power and longer battery and longer battery. Yeah, it's a bit bulky, but it makes up for well, it. But you get this, aspects. you get this thing, so you can put it. Like you don't have to put it on your belt as well. You can put it on your neck, whatever your jumpers, you know, whatever. Oh, your your boot or you know whatever's your particular fashion choice. You yeah. can go for that. So would you go solo too as well? I think I would. Yeah, yeah. Just because you know uh, Han Solo has been a long term favorite of mine, and you know it's it's very difficult for me to separate those two things in my mind, even though in reality they are completely separate. Well, that's all right. Glad we got an answer. Yeah. The age old question: Arise Air Two or Arise of Solo Two? I know. From the dawn of time, people mm. have been asking that yeah. question. Socrates and Plato used to have a punch up about it back in Greece. I'd well believe it. Yeah. I'd well believe we, that. We have solid. If only they were here now, they could make friends, and we could all, <laughs> we could all say, the Solo Two is the one we're all talking about <laughs> here, boys. Okay, and yeah. that's all from us at a uh, paper blog. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you.